Quinn's mom called and said that her little boy had requested a doll be casted for his sister. I go, do you think, is there any way if I bring a doll in you know, that you guys could make that happen? And I thought that was the sweetest thing. And they're like, absolutely, absolutely. I don't like seeing my babies hurt. You just relax, I got you, I'm not gonna hurt you. I just love kids, I do. I, anything to make a situation that's been stressful for a family better, I'm all for it. This is what goes up against the patient's skin to keep the cast material from rubbing the skin. Quinn Spike a cast came you know, right underneath her armpits. Every time we picked her up, you had to hold her by the cast. It's kind of like an ace wrap that just adheres to itself. It was even better than you know what I had imagined. The look on my son's face, you know, when he looked underneath the Christmas tree and saw this for Quinn, he's like, Mom, oh, it's a doll, and it has a spike cast, a purple spike cast. He made more of a fuss about the doll really than he did for his gifts. When they brought her back to us, she was awake and alert, and I was able to just immediately you know, grab her and hold her and, and cry. <laughs> My husband held her. Um, yeah, so I think all that day we just held on to her because we weren't able to do that. I was so surprised whenever they came back and she had her cast off. I hadn't seen her without her cast since she was a little bitty baby. Quinn was just as happy as can be and was laughing. I can't wait to see her walking. That's, I can, that'll be a great day when I see her in here walking. Oh.